Last September, Pirates catcher Chris Stewart volunteered to shave his head in order to raise money for pediatric cancer awareness. His barber that day was 11-year-old Anya Lamar, who was currently battling Ewing sarcoma, a rare form of bone cancer. How much were you charged, though? Can I afford you, is my question. You're famous. I oh, I like that. I just remember her smile that, that day, um, brought a smile to my face, and just seeing how uplifted she was with all that she was going through, uh, you know, it inspired me to you know, grind through what I think are tough days for me. Unfortunately, just a few months after that event, Anya's health took a turn for the worse. Her cancer had grown. Her family was considering a new medical trial in which she had to swallow pills, but she couldn't overcome her fear of taking pills, so she couldn't participate in the trial. There was one uh, immunotherapy that was suggested, which would have involved uh, swallowing capsules. And, and you can't scream at your child to take a pill, um, as everybody so, so thinks. Well, she should just do it. Well, okay, after three years of cancer and struggle and strife and all that, no, it's not that simple. And she had a, a true aversion to pill taking. After spending weeks in the hospital, Anya passed away just after Christmas 2016. Still so proud of her for all that she had been through and that was evident when at her funeral, sorry, by the love and support and the comments that people have made since then even about her and how much she has meant to them at such a young age. While she was still fighting, Anya was involved with Lending Hearts, a nonprofit organization that provides emotional and social support to kids with cancer. Lending Hearts founder Vaso Palioris was especially affected by Anya's death and decided to do something about it. When we watched Anya on her journey and our experience with our family, it really showed to us we really have to kickstart this. And it really made us think she can't be the only one experiencing these feelings of anxiety and stress and how it's impacting our overall health and when you extrapolate it out, the health of the family. In order to help relieve anxiety and stress in young cancer patients, Lending Hearts created Upstreet, a wellness program that involves yoga, exercise, and aromatherapy. Isabella Torres is currently involved in the Upstreet program and her family has seen a difference. Isabella gets the opportunity to be around other children um, that are just like her and I think it gives her the, the chance to, you know, empathize with other children that she may not otherwise have a chance to do unless she's in the hospital. Isabella recently received positive news from her doctor and her trademark smile lights up a room. It's not hard to think that this smile from young Anya Lamar is helping to keep that smile on Isabella's face along with many more kids helped by Lending Hearts Upstreet program. You know, put a smile on your face and it changes your attitude and uh, I know that she definitely inspired me to do that. And, you know, she lives on through me. I told her parents that, and uh, you know, it's unfortunate that she passed away, but I definitely know that she inspired me and probably inspired a lot of other people uh, uh, along her life as well.